Hey, what's going on everybody? This is hole number three of the Eastern Odyssey Tournament Expert Division Qualifying Ground. For our tee shot, we're going to use an APOC level four and above with either a Kingmaker or a Kingslayer ball. However, we're going to start off with a quarterback nine plus. Red ring touching the rough on the right at P3 max. Then we're going to swap over to our APOC sniper bag and apply 5.8 top spin with three left spin. Our adjustment is P0 max plus 20% elevation. Then we're going to apply max overpower with no curl. Ball's going to land in the first fairway, bounce over the rough into the next fairway, and we're going to finish with a drive distance of 361 yards. For our approach shot, we're going to use a sniper level 9+. plus. First thing I'll do is apply 4.5 top spin with 3 left spin. And then what we're looking for for our aim is this point where our ball guide glitches through the hole. So if you kind of see, I set up with the ball guide just to the front of the hole. And if I push forward slightly, the ball guide significantly increases through the hole. So we're about three, four squares through the hole. Then using our landing position plus yardage, which is plus one, which is equivalent to plus three. Our adjustment is P0 plus 20% elevation at 82% slider, which is 10.1 rings using sniper 10 numbers. If you adjust into overpower, then you're going to need to apply extra overpower as needed. We do not, so we're going to center the ball. <clears throat> we get perfect. Ball's going to land in the first fairway, bounce over the bunker to the next fairway, and then we're going to roll onto the green. The line looks like it might be okay, but obviously we are a decent bit short. Um, ultimately, the, the goal of this setup is to get safely to the green and two, get our eagle and move on. But I think if we add a little bit of overpower to this shot, maybe maybe just before circle drop, and pot potentially a little bit more on the adjustment as well, we can give ourselves a chance for the albatross. Um, but it's definitely going to be a difficult drop, at least with low-level clubs. For further instructions on how to play this hole, make sure you guys click the link below and subscribe to Expert Tournament Guides through Golf Clash Tommy. Good luck in your qualifying rounds.